Hello friends, my name is Ramasu. Today we shall discuss about topic the collect requirement process of project management. Friend, today's topic is very very interesting especially if you have interest in project management or you are planning to give exam or PMP in near future. So let's start. First of all, I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you. And also you can follow me on the Facebook page as well. Friend, collect requirement process is the second process of a scope management knowledge area. In order to define the scope, the requirements of the stakeholders must be collected first. The main purpose of the collect requirement process is gathering stakeholder requirements in a project. Collect requirement is the process of determining, documenting and managing stakeholder needs and requirements to meet objectives. The key benefit of this process is that it provides the basis for defining the product scope and project scope. Now if we talk about the inputs for uh, this process which are basically project charter, project management plan, project documents, business documents, agreements, enterprise environmental factor and organizational process assets. Now uh, the tools and techniques uh, to process the inputs are the expert judgment, data gathering, data analysis, decision making and other tools are uh, data representation, interpersonal skills, context diagram and the prototyping. Prototyping basically is a way through which we get the feedback of customer before we start actually the development. The outputs of collect requirements are requirement documentation. Now if you talk about requirement documentation is basically it describes how individual requirements meet the business need for the project. Requirement may start out at a high level and become progressively more detailed as more information about the requirements is known. The second uh, output uh, is basically the requirement traceability matrix. Requirement traceability matrix is a grid that links product requirements from their origin to the deliverables that satisfy them. The implementation of a requirement traceability matrix helps ensure that each requirement adds business value by linking it to the business and project objectives. It provides a means to track requirement throughout the project life cycle, helping to ensure that requirements approved in the requirements documentation are delivered at the end of the project. Finally, it provides a structure for managing changes to the product scope. So friend, uh, thank you. Thanks a lot for watching the video. I hope you like this video. If you like it, please share it with your friends and colleagues. And thanks a lot for watching the video.